The next piece of our story takes us to 1948, when the Dutch physicist Hendrik Casimir proposed the existence of a new and exciting type of force. Now, in modern physics, we believe that all events that occur in our universe are due fundamentally to one of four basic forces, gravity, electromagnetism, the weak nuclear force, and a strong nuclear force. However, something intriguing happens when you study the very nature of space-time from the perspective of quantum field theory, which is a highly successful and predictive theory that was developed predominantly in the latter half of the 20th century. Quantum field theory tells us that the vacuum of space is in fact not a sea of emptiness, not devoid of energy, but is in fact a seething inferno of virtual particles that pop into and out of existence in microscopic fractions of a second. This soup of virtual particles, which physicists call a quantum vacuum. Now, more than 50 years ago, while working for the Philips Research Laboratories in the Netherlands, Casimir made a stunning prediction. He predicted that two parallel conducting plates placed within a vacuum would alter the very nature of the quantum vacuum in such a way that these plates would be pulled towards each other by a force that could not be explained as being due to any of the four fundamental forces of nature. This Casimir effect, this force from nothing, is now a rich and active research area with hundreds of new publications appearing on this matter each and every year. Indeed, this was the topic of my own PhD research. But what does this have to do with warp drive and with superluminal propulsion. Well, there is one more piece to this jigsaw puzzle that we'll first need to understand. Extra dimensions of space. Thank you.